of dust I met two gin One bad as pride and thin The other was fat and dark as sin Isn't that how all good tales begin? The big one looked a lot like you The other one looked just like you too guitar. Glad you could be here today. Hope you're having a nice day. We have a very interesting request uh, from one of our subscribers, Becky, for Tu Jin, which is a song by uh, Scaring the Children, um, which is a side project of Bob Weir, who uh, co-founded The Grateful Dead with Jerry Garcia. And um, I actually saw the, the Grateful Dead with Jerry. Um, my dad taught uh, Phil Lesh's nephew in fifth grade. I'm from near the Bay Area. So I'm a huge fan of, of all that they do. And Bob Weir um, actually formed a number of side projects, including Rat Dog and this band, Scaring the Children, an interesting name, and a couple others as well. And I've always just had a huge respect for Bob Weir's rhythm guitar playing. Uh, his chord vocabulary is just immense and um, amazing songwriter. So I had a lot of fun learning this song and all the different chords he's playing. Some great guitar parts in there. So, uh, hope you will have fun as well, and um, let's figure out what's happening. Okay, so uh, we have this intro here, and we're going to be learning some very interesting chords in this song, and that's one of the great things about Bob Weir's playing. He just is very creative with how he plays chords. So we have this sort of A minor. Uh, a minor sus2 so what that is is first finger fourth string second fret third finger fourth fret third string pinky second fret second I'm uh, sorry fifth fret second string okay and then he moves his third finger and first finger up a fret Then he does the exact same thing up 12 frets. Now he's playing on an electric, so if you don't have a cutaway on an acoustic, you probably wouldn't need to play it on an electric. And he does a little a little frill there, a little um, down, down. But the same thing 12 frets up. So that would be 14th, 16th, and 17th fret. And then these fingers up a fret. If you just add 12 frets to whatever you're doing, you're actually playing the same notes an octave up, if you didn't know. One more time. Okay. He does that four times, and then the verse, uh, out on the road from West Marin. I'm from Sonoma County, by the way, so <laughs> I'm very familiar with Marin. Beautiful area. Um, you play uh, basically a B flat major seven sharp 11, which sounds complicated, but uh, you have a pinky on the eighth fret, fourth string, 
third finger, seventh fret, third string, and then you bar the fifth fret with the first two strings with the first finger. Out on the road from West Marin. Okay. So that's the chord. Hopefully you can see that. Then just moves it down to a regular A chord. So out on the road from West Marin. Now the third finger goes in the seventh fret, middle finger, sixth fret. And then he does a little pinky hammer on pull off on the eighth fret. Gives it that mystical quality. Repeat. Ah, uh, in a cloud of dust I met two gin. Okay. So you got that. Now we do a, uh, it's like this chord, except instead of the pinky here for this B flat, we bar the first finger on the fourth string, fifth fret, to play a G, a G minor kind of chord. All right. So you see that's fifth fret, seventh fret, fifth fret, fifth fret. Fifth fret. All bar with the first finger, seventh fret, third string. One, uh, one bread is light, pride and thin. Repeat, now B flat. The other was fat and dark as sin. And then last one, the G. The G is the one where we bar the first finger. Da, 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 da. Okay, that's the verse. Now we have the bridge, which is uh, C sharp minor bar chord, regular bar chord, one of the only regular chords in this song. Da, 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 da. Uh, so, the big one looked a lot like you. Now we have a D sus2. It's like a D bar chord, but instead we don't bar like that, and instead we do just a third finger and pinky on the fourth and third string, and leave the first two strings with the first finger on the fifth fret. Repeat that three times. Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. Okay, now we do a, a score of lies. So this is uh, not so easy, and he's probably not playing this, but the bass is playing this note. So to hear the song, you kind of need to do it. Third finger, seventh fret, sixth string. Pinky, seventh fret, third string. Bar, fifth fret with the first two strings with the first finger. A score of lines. You have to kind of mute the fifth and fourth strings a little bit with your third finger there. A score of lines. They swore was true. And now, a C over G, or uh, basically fifth fret, second and third strings with the third and fourth fingers. And then uh, G with the, with the bass. Uh, third fret with the sixth string. Swore were true. And then you move the pinky to the sixth fret. Isn't that what genies always do? Okay, so that was. And then back. Isn't that what genies always do? And then you can move it from fifth fret, second and third string to third fret if you want. Isn't that what genies always do? And then the next section. So we're moving kind of fast because this is a, at least an intermediate song uh, with the chords. So you've got those two sections. Now we've got the, the chorus. <clears throat> um, night comes sudden, dark, uh, dawn be soon. So that's an A. So now we're going to do straight bar chords. Night comes sudden, dawn be soon. Now E minor, but you hit the fourth, third, second string. Night comes sudden, dawn be soon. time. Night comes sudden, don't be soon. Okay. Fourth, third, second string of an E minor. D chord, D bar chord. Repeat. Ride my time by the dark of the... Now it's a G bar chord. Repeat. Da 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 da. But when I get there, they'll be gone. Right? Okay, then we go, then he does another verse bridge chorus, which you've learned. After the second verse bridge chorus, we have this cool little Grateful Dead-esque lick. Really cool, right? 
So we're going to do fourth position, meaning your first finger's in the fourth fret for everything. Fifth fret, sixth string. Seventh fret. Fourth fret, fifth string. Fifth fret. Pinky, seventh fret. Now, fourth fret, fourth string. Fifth fret. Fourth fret, fifth fret, fifth string, seventh fret. One more time. Okay, second half of the phrase. Seventh fret, fifth fret, fourth fret, fifth fret, fourth, duh. Fifth fret, sixth string, seventh fret, sixth, half, half, fifth, third, third. Seven five four five four five seven five three three. Here we go. Repeat. Okay. And the bass solos over that, and then Bob actually Bob Weir solos over that. The only part left is uh, this part. So that's a cool little section he's doing. Um, in the second, it's a 10 minute song, so there's quite a few things going on. So that's a A, a chord here. So we're gonna do fifth fret to sixth fret hammer on on the third string, and then the first two strings barred on the fifth fret, and then move everything down two frets for the G, and then do fifth fret, second string, fourth fret, third string, slide down two frets and then first string open. And then the same chord as before with the A, except you keep hammering on and pulling on the sixth fret, third string. That's so it's. Uh. Right? Then he responds with this. Responds with that. All right, and then the song basically, he uh, he sings about how dream, dreaming dreams aren't real, or or dream, dreams are a lie, but then dreaming is real. And when he says dreaming is real, he goes back into right. And then basically that beginning part, and then he ends basically in, in, a, in that A sus chord. So um, there you go. There's all the parts. I know we kind of had to move a little quickly there, but I think uh, you know. Any questions you have, please always comment. I will I will answer them and, and clear it up for you. All right. All right. Great job. So you've got this wonderful song under your belt, and we've actually got some more Grateful Dead song requests coming up the next couple weeks so um, go ahead and subscribe and leave a comment hit the notification bell tune into the daily guitar lessons and uh, have a great day everybody we'll see you next lesson bye <laughs>